morning. Thought I'd just give people a little update of uh, how I've been feeling because I did it, I don't know, was it three weeks ago? About a new routine, about saying how I was struggling and all that. Um, I stuck to it. I, I think I've done, I think I've been out 17. It's a little mile walk around the around the block. and I've. But today I've come out, try and catch the sunrise. Um, up on Hanging Stone, which is one of the Everish things. I think uh, Luke, uh, Richie, Darren and Gilson, Karen McCautry came on this one. We did it in snow. The, the day we got lost. Um, yeah, I've been good. I've enjoyed getting out of my body, kind of, if I'm not up and about. So today, I wanted to see how far I could actually get, because if I don't do stuff, my body really does suffer. So I've set out today to try and see how I'm getting on, how I could get on, sorry. But the little round trip for a mile each day has been working well. It's just keeping me going. I'm going to try and do this, this month 30 miles. I'm not setting too many challenges like people are doing, because I can't get access to a physio, so I'm going to struggle. And, um, but mental health's been all right. It's been a tough few weeks for a lot of us because of uh, what happened to Paul. But <laughs> what, even though I'm sad as hell about it, you know, the positive I'm going to take is Paul rang me that Saturday before, like the previous, before he passed away, and I answered the phone, and he rang me just to, because he saw the video on Facebook, and he rang me to see how it was. Speaks volumes to the guy, doesn't it? He, um, he rang me to check up on me, and I spoke to him for half an hour, and it was great. He, he, he sounded so positive. It was so nice to hear. But what I've kind of taken out of that is, because you can still be sad and take positives. And I've got a bit slack, not answering the phone to people and, and stuff like that. So if I've taken anything out of it at the minute, I'm going to take the fact I'm going to try and reach out to people. I'm going to try and video call them, speak to my friends and, and not put things off because we just don't know what's going to happen. Um, so yeah, I've tried to take that out of it. I've tried to reach out over the last couple of weeks. So now do you fancy a video call and a video chat, even though I feel awkward as hell on videos like now. So it's something for you to think about while you're having your cornflakes and coffee in the morning. Um, also, I took myself away from any negativity. I, I was in a lot of WhatsApp groups and I found it, I found it quite negative. And it, it wasn't them, it was me. Um, I didn't enjoy it and I, some people thought I was overlooking, overthinking things, but I wasn't. It was just, if something has a negative effect on you, take yourself away from it. Um, it was no offence to the people that do it, they're good friends of mine. Um, it was just, I've changed, I suppose, which we're doing time and I, I've changed compared to what I, was, what I was and what they see as banter. I don't, but that's fair, absolute fair enough. It's, we all have different, different types of banter. Um, but yeah, I've got a friend who, the farm, she, she's a, uh, she set off running. She's never really run before and she set off running. She did a mile or a couple of miles to start off with. The other day she ran a half marathon. And this is all in the space of a few weeks. So if you're thinking about getting out, start small and just get on because you just crack on. I'm going to try and do this and just do a mile a day. And by the end of the month, I've done 30 miles and it's keeping me going. But do you know what? If you don't end up doing it, like I say, I've missed three days, I think, two days, two or three days, but I've not beat myself up about it. I've gone, well, my body's telling me. But, after the Granger thing, I did speak to a counsellor. A counsellor, speaking to a counsellor. Um, go out and speak to someone, speak to a friend, then go and speak to a proper counsellor if you're struggling with it. Not struggling with anything, just go speak to them. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to give people an update really, because I, obviously I, I get a lot of messages checking up on me, but I'm absolutely fine. Um, so yeah, if you uh, get anything from this video, give it a share. But, uh, oh yeah, before anybody starts, I know that I shouldn't be out, but I'm out. It's six o'clock in the morning. I set off at four. Well, me and Gemma set off at four. We're not coming into contact with anybody. We're not touching anything. So I need to get out because if I don't, my body will just seize up. I've already had my, my physio on the phone and uh, I can't get to her. Okay. We didn't go in the car. This is 
Awal awal sih tahun lah semua. Right. Have a good day, people. See you later.